Hello, my name is Michael Peter and in this short video, I want to talk to you a little bit about Plasphy and Deal Coca. Now, I'm a digital entrepreneur and also a musician by hobby. Uh, this digital marketing field has been part of me for the last uh, almost 20 years. So, kind of this, this is again, not just my job, which also uh, has been my career for the last 20 years. So digital marketing, digital entrepreneurship. And now, uh, when it comes to entrepreneurship, I want to tell you something. I need a lot of graphics for different purposes. And right there behind me, you can see the different kinds of graphics that Plasphy offers. Now, what's to say that there are not other tools out there that offer all these? Yeah. Who, who says that there's no competition? Plasphy is one of the competitors among the many in the market today. And of course, so Plasphy is competing with, the, with one of the biggest ones, Canva. Anyway, so I want to take you into, into Plasphy. This is my account, what you see here. I want to take you through this uh, platform and I want to show you what, is, uh, what it can do for you, basically. So how I use Plasphy and uh, how maybe even you can use Plasphy if you decide to get in or if you're already there, well and good. But right, let me share my screen and let's go into Plasphy and see uh, what we can learn from there. Okay, which window is it? Uh, let's see now. All right, sharing my screen, just hold on. Okay, so... I don't know where you see me right now, whether I'm at the top or at the bottom, but here on the screen, I have Plasphy open. And the first thing that you will realize is that Plasphy has about 17,300 templates. It's a plus there, right? So there's a lot more than that. And these are the template categories that you will find within the software, within the platform, yeah? Album covers. Um, I don't know if I'd use that, but it's there in case you want to use it. These here, this section is for your blogs and websites or anywhere where you have, uh, where you can actually use these kinds of ads. AdSense, if you're into AdSense, then this is going to help you. Blog cover, uh, headers, book covers. Now, before I go on and just read all that's here, you can already see them, right? As an entrepreneur, I need graphics for my book cover. I need, I'm an author as well. You can find some of my books on Amazon. Okay, so I need covers, uh, book covers. I need um, Facebook ads or different kinds of ads. I need infographics, sometimes to explain things within the blogs. Uh, I would love to have some graphics for my LinkedIn posts. And uh, of course, logos, don't forget the logos. Uh, there's plenty of logos here that you can choose from. And I think uh, that's a very useful thing. Mind maps, uh, then what else? So if you're into the restaurant business by any chance, there's a lot of many options to choose from, menu designs. Okay, what else, what else, what else? I need presentations. Uh, I need posters. I need viral images. To just to create some brand awareness. And then I need something for my YouTube, thumbnails and channel art, and that goes for my Facebook as well. So my social media, uh, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, I need some banners or channel art for all of them. And everything's here, everything's here. So that's the beauty of this. Now, uh, what I want to tell you is that, um, let me be honest with you, last week, is still in its, um, I don't know, I should say infancy. Not really. It's moved on uh, way a lot more than infancy. It's not in its infant state right now. I should say somewhere in the toddler years where it's growing, it's uh, increasing in strength and power and capabilities. And um, it's, it's a very good uh, competitor for Canva. Might I even say that Plasphy has features that Canva doesn't have. Of course, Canva is a much, much, much larger business. Uh, they, they have a huge team of developers behind them. 
and there's a the huge company and for someone like plasby to come and say i'm competing with you that, that's a big thing that's really a big thing anyway now enough said uh, i can go on rambling about it but let me show you what plasby is capable of okay so here's the one thing i was just playing around with uh, the masks within plasby and this is something that i just came up with uh, random so i got a heart shape so how do i get that i go to elements and then here I can select all the different kinds of elements that I want. So I chose the shapes and within the shapes, I have again, so many different kinds of shapes I can choose from. I just went with the black ones. I clicked on view all and I scroll down and chose the heart shape. And then once I choose a heart shape now, so just to demonstrate it for you, let me choose another shape. Let's choose something weird, something that's, Okay, let's <laughs> let's try this one. Okay, so I'm going to put it here, uh, drag it up, then let's put this one here, and then here I'm going to choose this add mask. Once I click on that, this is going to change into the mask option. Now I can go to the photos, and I've been searching for some things. I'll show you in just a minute. Let's see. Um, let's see if we can get some pictures of donuts. Okay, there we have some nice delicious looking donuts okay let's get this one it's got a lot of them so all i have to do now is click on the image and it'll fill in that shape isn't that beautiful did i speak too soon <laughs> no okay so now what i see is that this is really not standing out from the background the background is pink this one is kind of pink so if i had actually got this donut it would stand out so I just need to click again and within a few seconds that image is going to replace the one i had earlier and now we have it so that's one easy way to do it let's look at another one i tried text so i put the text in here and just click on the text mask okay so now it's already done i'm not able to show you that but i just clicked on the text mask went into the photos look for a picture that actually represented dubai and clicked on it that's about it I didn't do anything else. Now, what you can do with the images is that you can upload your own. You can uh, just input an image URL. So if you have a if you have a URL, maybe you're looking at Pixabay or any other place where you have an, where you can actually grab the URL of the image. You can put that in here, and it's going to fetch it. You can also grab a YouTube thumbnail. Uh, interesting stuff, which <laughs> Canva doesn't have. Okay, so let's look at the next one. Uh, I was also working on another one. I typed this one and notice that there's not one image in this text. There's one, two, three, four, five, six images in this text clipping mask. And how did I do it? I just added each letter separately. I added a text for G, for R, for E, for E, for C and E separately. And so I could use each of these alphabets as a separate clipping mask. And I added a background. It's just as easy. So how do you add a background? Just go to backgrounds and you could either choose image, color or gradient. If you notice in the previous one, I chose a gradient. And in this one, again, it was a gradient. But in the last one for Greece, I selected image and I chose that image to fill the background. I just need to click on image and that's going to fill it up. Okay, so it's that easy. Now let's go to the other one that I said I need some graphics for channel art, right? YouTube channel. So here it is. I have a lot of templates to choose from here. Okay, I can't say there are tons of them, but there's enough and more to choose from. You're not going to run out of ideas. And of course, who to, who's to say that you have to just be limited to these templates? These templates are here or in any other software for that matter as a starting point. All you have to do is take the template and customize it for your brand, your business, your blog, your whatever. Okay, so I named this one Easy Dot Tuts Tutorials, and my channel is ready. So the just take a look. So let me just uh, click on that. That's to add a new page. This is to clear the design. This is to duplicate the page. This is uh, to copy that image, and this is to delete it. So I just I'm I'm going to add another. Uh, template now let's see which one shall we do i mean music i said but uh, let's do something that i'm listening to music okay i just click on that 
and give it a few seconds and it's done. Okay, so this thing has to be done here. And there we go. Simple design, easy. And all you have to do is customize it. Now, is this a picture? No, this, this entire thing is a background. So <clears throat> what if you want access to some images like this, which are which don't have a background? <clears throat> That's where their uh, platform, Deal Coca, comes in. I am happy that I'm part of that platform, that membership, because it's just a one-time membership and I get access to millions of assets for all of my graphic designs, right? Uh, I'll talk about that a little later on. Now, let me go to the next one, which is the book covers that I spoke about. Book covers, very important. So here's some examples of the book covers that you can actually create. See, I'm scrolling down and there's a lot of them. Now, if you notice, these are very, very different from the book covers you would see on Canva. On Canva, there's hardly any book covers like these. And if you know, these kind of book covers are really catchy. They, they immediately grab attention because the heading is very clear. For example, if, uh, if I were to pick up one of the books that I have here, let me just show you if I can see that. Okay, I have a book here, uh, you can see it. How simple is this? How simple is this? Very simple, right? Launch by Jeff Walker is just one arrow in that. And our designs here have a lot more than that. They've got good uh, font selections. They've got uh, good sizable font and it's very easy to read. Now, the problem with book covers when you have an image a real image, some kind of image, a photo at the background, it's very difficult to uh, create text that stands out. I'm sure you have, have run into that issue. And th these templates make it easy for us to create covers that really stand out. Uh, now, now what, I, what you see on the screen here is a template that we got, got from Plasco. And I'm going to scroll down to see the next page, which I customized. I customize it. Oh, now take a look at this. These stars are not, not all they Okay. It's not proper. It was like this. And now they look like this. I don't like them. And uh, I want to change them. Okay. So I'm going to select all this. Now I'm just going to show you how you do things. Okay. So when I selected all that, notice that it selected the black rectangle. It selected this entire rectangle. So all you have to do is press down shift. Oops, I selected that one. Okay, press down shift and down. now that's deselected. Press down shift and now that's deselected and now only that is selected. So I'm just gonna hit the delete button. I don't want those things. Now I want to select this one and make copies of it. Okay, so let me make, a, I made a copy of it. I'm gonna put it here. Now let me select these two, shift and select. Control C, Control V, and I've got them. Now I'm going to put them there, and I'm going to select these two again. Uh, Control C, Control V, and I've got four now. Okay, now I'm going to select all four. You might think, ah, this is too tedious. Okay, wait and see what I'm going to do next. Oops, what I wanted. Now it's. Okay, any graphic program, when you have to select multiple icons, it's going to be difficult for you. Now we've got all the stars there. Uh, this black thing has to move a little bit. Okay, got it. Now these stars, are they centered? I don't know, but let's do something. Let's select all the stars. Okay, unselect the black and this one. Now only the stars selected. Now look at this. Right click and distribute horizontal. Okay. Instantly, they've been distributed horizontal. Now that is something we don't want. That was a star that was there earlier, perhaps. Now, once again, I have to distribute because I didn't know that star was there. Okay, selected that, unselect, unselect, and let's move this a little bit and distribute horizontal. Perfect. 
perfectly centered. Did it take too much time? I don't think so, right? You can uh, change all of this. So notice that I changed the image here and this image, I got it from within here. Go to element, search for it and you get your image. I just searched on social. And again, I'm saying, if you don't like these, you can of course upload your own image and import it here. Now here's another template that is in, in the system. Okay, uh, should be here somewhere. Yeah, it's there. And I customized it to affiliate marketing. I use the exact same template. The pictures are all the same. Uh, I didn't want to spend too much time editing it, but there we go. I've got a book title and book cover, I mean, and I've customized it. It's mine now, right? It's so simple. Of course, you want to change your colors and some of the designs to just stand out from your competition, but it's so easy. It's done, right? Now let's go to another one. Okay. Uh, so here we have some Facebook ads. How do we do this? <clears throat> this is the template which was built in and I customized it and created this. The image was from inside here. I just searched for illustrations and I got this really super high quality image and just changed all these uh, titles here. And that's mine now, right? This is a template from inside here. And this is what I did. Pretty simple, simple change. I just changed the background and the background is there. And there's an overlay a rectangle with the color transparency and it's done. So let me just show you what else you can do with this. So if you select the text, these are all the different options you can choose for the text. You can have the text mask, like we already saw earlier, the text color, the alignment, you can have it as uppercase, lowercase, or different kinds. So you have bold, italics, uh, as the font allows. Then you have the line height and spacing. This feature is very, very important, and it's also there in Canva. Uh, then you have the stroke, if you want it. Then you have the shadow, adding the text effects. Then you have the gradient. Oh yeah, this is not there in Canva. So let's add a gradient to this. What gradient would look good? Let's add this one. See how easy it is to really um, beautify your graphics in just one click. I know this video is running too long, but let me go quickly to the next one. This is skyscraper. Like we looked earlier, this is something, this graphic is something you can use for your blogs and websites and maybe anywhere else where you can actually advertise these. Maybe uh, traffic exchanges, if they allow skyscrapers, you can do that. And this one here is uh, a graphic from inside here. I didn't actually type all this, I just got it. And I changed the color. The color, you wanna change it to a different color? Let's do it. Instant, let's do it and you can uh, match the color to your brand. And it's as simple as that. It's really that simple. So I just spoke to you about Blast Free for such a long time now. Honestly speaking, um, is there something I don't like about it? Um, I learned the hard way. So the last time I worked on it, I created a design and I forgot to save it. So saving is very simple. There's a little button here, save, save it, keep saving. Oh, this is like the earlier versions of Microsoft Word when you had to, there was no auto save. You had to hit the control S to keep saving your work. Last is like that right now. But I'm sure uh, auto save feature is in the pipeline or if I'm not wrong, it might already be there. Uh, maybe they're working on it. Last is a program, a tool, a software, an app that is being developed currently. And there's a long roadmap of features and improvements that are coming up. Jasper and his team have done a fantastic job on this product and I'm really, really happy. So let me go to the other software. software it's a membership actually. It's called the Deal Coca and this is, this is it. This is something I really, really, really love. Okay, because I got access to tons of things here. Okay, so if I go to Software Products World, I might not have access to everything, but let's see what we can access. It might take a little time, but uh, don't worry, it's gonna load up and it's gonna show us what all is available in Deal Coca. 
And again, remember, right now it's they they're running a, a one time kind of offer, and you get in, you you're in for life. Software, 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 software. These are software products that you can actually use, and of course, they you get some of these for free in the VIP membership. And some you got to pay for, and that's okay. You still pay a lot less than what you would if you were to go to the original vendor. So I'll just show you one more thing about uh, uh, the Deal Coca. They have PLR products, tons of them. And uh, even a single PLR product, if you download from there, it's worth the price it's worth more than the price of both Plasti and Deal Coca put together. Okay, you got some premium products and uh, all the creative resources, there's so many. And guess what? They have stuff for Canva as well. So uh, though they're a competitor, they're not um, stopping you from using Canva as well if you have access to it already. All right, I think I spoke a lot and I think I'll stop for now, but I hope you really saw the power of Plasby and how Plasby can actually uh, do things for your business, improve your business, make things faster, seamless, um, a lot of things. Anything to do with your graphic needs? Yes, this is your tool. Uh, believe me, I just read an email today uh, that Canva has increased their prices, especially for the team's um, plan. That's going to cost you a lot monthly right? Monthly subscription for Canva. They have a lot of features, of course, but Plasby is coming up with a lot of features too. And this is just one time. So just think about it. If you're just, for example, if you're paying $200 for Canva subscription per year for Plasby, you're going to pay just how much? $10 or less. Uh, that is, I paid, yes, $10 or less because I got in on the offer and if the offer is still running, Think you should get into if you if you're not in already. I'd love to see you inside. I'd love to see what you create, uh, and maybe somewhere let's share. It's a, we we are all part of the Facebook group as well, so we can share our our work there. Anyway, so I know I spoke a lot, but once again, thank you Jasper and team for creating this wonderful product. I love it. By uh, the way, I just forgot logos. How did I forget to show you this thing? This is massive. This is really, really massive. There are thousands of logos here. You just need to choose anyone, customize all the colors, customize the text, make it your own, and you'll be done with the professional looking logo in just seconds, if not minutes, right? I had to say it. I had to say it. Uh, once again, thank you, Jasper and team. Love this product. Continue to use it. <laughs> I wish many more join before you close the offer. Uh, again, thanks, and uh, I hope to see you guys in, inside somewhere. Let's meet. Yeah, bye for now.